Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. Post nasal drip could be connected to your digestive area. You need to avoid the following foods, sugar, wheat, dairy, fruit juices, coffee, tea, alcohol, cigarettes, processed and fast foods. Basically all man-made denatured foods.15 September 2003. Make your mark, take our lead. To provide relief, you need a mucus substitute and honey is ideal. Honey is sticky and thick, providing a protective membrane over the mucus membranes. Honey has natural antibacterial properties and contains an enzyme that converts into hydrogen peroxide when combined with salt and water. Let's help you make your mark. As much as it is recommended to eat a banana for a healthy body, it is also advised to stay away from bananas during cold or flu. If you have sinus issues then don't eat bananas after sunset. It has a cooling nature and causes congestion, sore throat.2 April 2019. Let's help you make your mark. Non-allergic triggers of post-nasal drip may include worsening symptoms with weather changes, exposure to strong odors or perfumes, eating spicy foods, gustatory rhinitis, or as a result of taking various medicines for high blood pressure, medication-induced rhinitis. Take our lead. Continued. Take a medication such as Guifenesin, Mucinex. Use saline nasal sprays or irrigation, like a neti pot, to flush mucus, bacteria, allergens, and other irritating things out of the sinuses. Turn on a vaporizer or humidifier to increase the moisture in the air. The 22nd of June 2020. Take our lead. Saline nasal sprays can help moisten your nasal passages and reduce symptoms of post-nasal drip. If you have continual problems with post-nasal drip, your doctor may prescribe a cortisone steroid nasal spray. Sinus irrigation tools like neti pots or sinus rinses like those from Neilmed can also flush out excess mucus. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.